Welcome to the channel. As you can see guys, I am in my new building. And as I've said, I'm gonna be powering my new building, at least temporarily, with these portable generators that I have. Now this is one of my favorites. This is a new one you have not seen yet. Uh, this is uh, the All Powers SP700. Now it has 606 uh, watt hours. Uh, it's pretty small. As you can see, for having so many watts, uh, man, I like it because you you can just take this with you anywhere you go. It's light. Now, right now, I've got it on. I believe it's at 93%. I can't. I've also got some solar panels that go with it, which I'm in the shade right now. It is very, very windy outside, so I'm just going to show you the panel. You've seen me do other reviews with this and show the, uh, how easy it is to hook up the solar panels. So I'm just going to show you that, and it's a very nice solar panel, 140 watt. And it folds up actually smaller than some of the bigger 100 watts. So let me get this box out of the way. It'll, the first thing it does, it comes in the box. Of course it comes in the box. I think they mail it in an envelope? No. And you're going to pull out the box. It'll have your instructions right there. It's got you a box in there. Go ahead and get that out of the way. And I believe this head, it's got your DC outlet for your vehicle. Uh, it comes with some barrel plugs and different kinds of adapters. It also, added, this came with the solar panel, I believe. You also get more of the same and a USB port. There's also a uh, place on the back of the panel. I'm gonna show you that here in a minute that you can charge your phone directly from the panel. It's pretty cool. Uh, we have two AC outlets here. Now to turn the Bluetooth feature on, which I will show you, there is an app. You download the All Powers app. And it's telling you everything on the app. It's telling me that I got 93%. You can operate all the functions from the app. You know, you're sitting in a chair, you don't want to get up. Hey man, pull out your phone, doodle doodle doodle. Do whatever does whatever you want. So if you're not using the app, you want to turn on the AC power, you put a long hold on that. You'll hear the fans kick on. So now you are ready to plug in anything with an AC outlet that requires an AC outlet. Also, at the same time, one short click, you can plug into your DC, to your vehicle, or whatever you want to do with the DC outlet. This is where your uh, solar panel will plug in with, I think these are the M MP4 cords or whatever, with this end, but it also gives you another one that has a barrel in. Hope you can see it. And you can plug that in right there. So you got two options for solar panels. I'd say the whole thing's less than 10 pounds. And you know, again, I say it's 700 watts. So I have a 500 watt unit that's much bigger than this. Then over here, you got three USB C's. And what's that other? The other USB. USB A B. USB C. And then them other ones. And your DC output is right there. So, it also comes with the wall, if you want to plug it in with your grid power. It comes with this unit here, it's actually two pieces, this will be detached from that. And you simply just plug it into your wall. And this end here, which has the barrel plug, can also go right there. So, plenty of cool features, I believe these are for uh, jumper cables, or just some alligator clips. I don't know if this one has the jumper uh, feature or not. Some of them do. Also comes with LED lights. Help light up the area if you're out at night. You got a couple of lights that you can turn on. Just two quick taps and they're out. All right, now to turn it off, another long hold. And another long hold on that. 
And I believe it stays lit for a little bit and then it goes out. But I've been using this in this shed. Let's go ahead and kick her back on, I'll show you. To power the light, because I don't have any lights in here. So I simply just get my lamp. We're gonna plug that dude in right there. We got a Halloween light, see? All right, now let's go look at this solar panel. I'm gonna turn you around. It comes with four panels. And it has the little kickstands on the back. Now if this was outside, I'd have it sitting out in the grass. There's currently no sun. I'm doing this in the morning. Now right here is where your cords and that are. But that little unit there you can plug into and it has USB ports in it. So you can charge your phone. You know, if you don't want to power up that unit, you can just put your solar panels out and charge your phone up with. And uh, all the legs just kicked in, so I'm going to have to lay her down. And, just... and there's your solar panels. And it charges fairly quick uh, with the solar panels. And it charged in no time uh, with the wall outlet. I think it was a little bit of Maybe right at about an hour, but a pretty nice unit, guys. So might want to go check it out. I'll leave a link in the description for you. Um, I'm getting as many. Of these, I want. I'll take as many of these as I can get. I've got bigger ones. And they're all coming in here. See, I have no electricity in here, and I'm gonna see if the bigger one might power my laser print. You know, but these smaller ones. That's plenty to run a fan, several lights, whatever you want to power. And I've used this several times. I had it charge at 100%, and it's only down to 92, and I've used it for a while. I even had uh, the Alex plugged into it to play some music. So that's going to be one of my favorites. So I'll leave the link in the description, guys. Check it out. Happy trails. Mm -hmm.